Are there a couple of things in your Mark 7 GTI or R that you thought just weren't quite right, like a little bit annoying, and you thought, why didn't Volkswagen just do that in the first place, or why did they do it that way? Well, you're not alone, and this is really easily fixable if you've got yourself either an ODB 11 or a Rostec cable. First one's a real must-have for me. It's the seatbelt chime. It's 2018. If anyone needs a chime to tell them to turn their seatbelt on, I think they shouldn't be driving a car. Luckily, it's really easy to fix. Turn it off. Notes are below. The second one's the fan speed indicator. The fan speed indicator are those little LEDs that are on the center dial of your air conditioning system, which all of a sudden disappear whenever you have the AC on auto, which for me is like all the time. I never don't have it on auto. So why would I not want to know the intensity of the fan? Doesn't make sense. Luckily, easily fixed. The third one is the traffic monitoring. Now, this may be a bit of a, a regional tweak. Um, I don't think it's necessary to perform this tweak in the US, but it's definitely necessary to perform this in Australia. When we press the traffic button, we get nothing. And when we use the built-in nav, we don't actually get any indication of how congested, and I can't use that information to make decisions when routing. But if you do this tweak, that all comes back. Really easy to do, instructions below. Now the fourth one is the direct acceleration tweak. Now this is a real big one. This is the dead pedal fix. It's that little lag when you press the accelerator pedal before something actually happens. And depending on how old you are, maybe you haven't driven a car with a traditional, uh, a traditional throttle which feels much more responsive. Now, it, this doesn't 100% get rid of it, but it improves the pedal feel by quite a lot. Now, the best way to notice this is to actually put the car in eco mode, where the pedal is especially dead. Drive around with that, then do the tweak, keep it in eco, then see how it feels. It's way different. It actually feels quite similar to how the pedal is in sport. Is it the same? Maybe. All I know is it's a better car to drive with this tweak. Okay, fifth and final tweak. Now this is also perhaps a little bit of uh, preference bias on my part. This is the tweak for the five brake lights. Now from factory, and maybe picture this more for the halogen tail lights rather than the lead tail lights, and definitely ignore this for the facelift tail lights. But for regular Mark 7 halogen tail lights, they both have those two little L's, and at night time, all four of them are illuminated to indicate for your driving lights. When you brake, only the outer two are illuminated. It looks totally unbalanced, totally weird. The inner two still stay just partially illuminated, and the outer two are bright. Looks really dumb. Same thing does happen on the LED lights. Maybe it doesn't look as bad. Luckily, it's easily fixable with some coding. Thanks for watching the video. Please like and subscribe. I've got some great GTI Club Sport and track content coming up. You don't want to miss it. So until next time, have fun in your cars and keep it on the black stuff.